Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Inger's Pink World. How are y'all doing? Happy New Year. I know I'm pretty late. I know it's the end of January and I'm just getting around and telling you guys Happy New Year face to face. But I'm um, Happy New Year. I hope everybody is so far having a wonderful 2022. How has everybody been doing? I feel like I have not been on camera in so long. Um, if you follow me, then you know why. <laughs> um, I have not been doing very well. Um, last couple of weeks for me have just not been good physically. Um, but I feel better today. Um, I'm starting to get my, my energy level is starting to come back up. And I thank God for that. So I said, well, you know what? Now's as good a time as any for me to sit down and do a sit down Happy New Year video with you guys while I feel really good. Um, I have been trying to keep the content coming, you guys, even though I haven't been able to sit down and do a face to face with you. I have been trying to keep the content coming. I've been trying to especially get an early start on Valentine's Day this year. I've tried to do a lot of Valentine's Day videos because I know it's the end of January now and we're coming up on that time. So I thought, hey, why not? Let's be consistent and just go ahead and start Valentine's early. So that's what I did. Um, so hopefully you have been enjoying those Valentine's Day videos. Um, I think I've pretty much put a little bit of everything out there. I think I've done Valentine's cupcakes, cookies, different Valentine's gifts that you can give to your significant other. And I think I did a reef video too. I do have some tutorials coming, you guys, because I have some new projects that I simply cannot wait to share with you. I um, mean, I'm actually going to do a tutorial on a couple of them to show you how I actually make them so that you can make them too. So I'm really excited about that. Um, just trying to stay consistent. I have been writing things down in my planner every day as far as my YouTube channel goes for things that I want to accomplish and my goals. And I'm checking off what I have already accomplished and the goals that I, I was striving for that I've already made. Um, today, when I checked my uh, YouTube studio, um, for those of you that don't know, YouTube studio is where we go to look at um, our analytics and, um, you know, different things about our content and stuff as we are filming these videos. And um, I was looking and I believe I'm at 384, maybe 84 or 85 subscribers. For those of you who have subscribed to my channel, thank you so much. I am very grateful for you. Thank you for hanging on. Um, for my subscribers who subscribed to me last year, thank you for still sticking with me. Um, I know it's kind of been touch and go here and there lately because, um, you know, when I don't feel well, I, I simply don't do anything, you know, and I don't get a lot of my filming in. You guys, I'm trying to film near my window so I can get some natural lighting. So if it seems like it's getting light and then dark, it's the sun going up and down. But um, I love natural light, so I'm trying to catch it while I can today. But um, anyway... So I hope everybody had a wonderful holiday season. I hope Christmas and New Year's was fabulous for everybody. And now that we are in 2022, um, there are so many different new things going on. I see a lot of people are doing the envelope challenges and let's save money challenges. And I am with it. I, I just haven't decided which one I want to do yet, but I definitely want to get in on that too. Um, like I said, I'm a little late getting in on everything because probably the past two and a half to three weeks now, I have just been in bed, not feeling well, trying to get my body to adjust to new medications that I'm on and things of that sort. And I just haven't been doing very well. So, <clears throat> you know, now, like I said, now that I'm starting to get my energy level back up, February the 1st, I will be starting my exercise program and my yoga program. I will be getting back into that. And I kind of think that will kind of help me you know, and help my body to just get back to normal and to, to get back to feeling how I just want to feel like, I just want to be full of energy, you guys, so that I can do these YouTube videos and do my crafting and, you know, all of these projects that I want to really get done and be able to show you. So, um, <clears throat> that's the plan. Um, I did finally get my mixed tiles up. Um, if you guys haven't seen that video, please go back and take a look at that video. I got all my mixed tiles up in my room and I absolutely love 
the way they turned out. So listen, you guys, um, of course, this is not sponsored because I'm not a big enough create, create, I'm not a big enough um, content creator yet to have subscriptions, have people um, uh, do my videos for me yet. Um, what am I trying to say? Be a sponsor yet. So, but if I were going to do anybody, I would definitely do mixed tiles. I would love for mixed tiles to sponsor me because I do believe in their product. I absolutely love the way my whole wall design turned out. And I even had to tweak my design a little bit because I was kind of running out of space where I wanted to put them up on both walls. But the way I did it, it turned out perfect. So if you guys have not tried mixed tiles and you want some pictures, but you you know you have a small amount of space, or even if you have a large amount of space and you can you can have about 20 or 30 tiles put up, try mixed tiles, you guys. The pictures come out so clear and so fabulous. And if you're doing a color scheme like I did, it just really comes out good. It really does. It's it's fabulous. So mixed tiles, I, I definitely recommend them. And I think I told you in a video of mine before, they have specials all the time. So sometimes they'll do 10 mixed tiles for $69. Sometimes they'll do, um, what's the other one they did? Buy, buy 10, get 10 free. They do specials all the time. So it's very affordable. And the best part about mixed tiles, they do not mess up your walls. So you can take them down and put them back up and take them down and rearrange them. And they're never going to peel the paint off of your walls and then there's no putting anything up with nails and drills and hammers so your walls always stay nice so that's what i like about that so you guys check out mixed tiles if you haven't um and um yeah so that's what's been going on with me so far this year you guys um i have been going through a lot physically so i think that i am on the path to getting better um, I have a lot of doctor's appointments ahead of me, so I'm just going to pray on it and keep a positive attitude and just a, a positive headspace about the whole thing, you know. Um, even though some of the medications that I take, they were making me so sick, and that was one reason why I couldn't do any content. Um, but you know, I'm feeling I'm feeling a little bit better now, and you know, I'm just I'm just looking forward to all of the great things that 2020 2020. Let's not take us back. <laughs> 2022 has to offer. I'm ready. Um, so that's what we're going to do. Um, my Disney trip was pushed back. You guys, you probably see that now because I was supposed to go this month, but it's been pushed back to April. Um, one do one reason for that is because I've been so sick. Um, also my father hasn't been doing very well. So I've been helping my mom with him. So January just wasn't the time. So uh, April is my birthday. We'll kind of see how things go with that. Um, and it's kind of been pushed back till then. We went ahead and, you know, kept the hotel and stuff booked for April now. And, you know, that's one thing about me and my mom. We're very, very flexible since we're, you know, we're all retired in the house. Nobody works. So we're very flexible with what we can do and when we can do it. So if we have something planned and it doesn't work out, we're like, eh reschedule you know and that even goes for airline tickets because most of these airline tickets even if you can't you know go when you say you were going to go the ticket is usually up good up for a year so you're still okay with that you know so that's what we've been doing we've been still planning you know because listen at the end of the day everybody needs a vacation i stick to that that's always been a motto of mine everybody needs a break from everyday life you know, from your everyday routine, you know, whether you're working or you're not working, you know, you're working at home, you're going to the office. I think at least once a year, everybody needs a break. You need a mental break from your job and, and just your everyday routine. And you definitely need a physical break. So um, I believe in that for everybody. So, you know, if you can take your vacation you know, whether it be your summer break, your winter break, your spring break, whenever you can get a break, you know, just to um, rest and relax and, you know, just do some things that you want to do. Try to try to do that. You know, you work hard and you deserve it. So um, I've also been looking at a lot of YouTube videos that are very inspirational for me um, as far as 
daily vlogging because that's something that I wanted to get into. But, you know, so far I haven't been able to really get into that groove mainly because of my health. But daily vlogging is something that I would love to get into in the future. And I watch a lot of um, other YouTubers that do it and they do it so well. So, you know, it, it gives me hope and it, it really inspires me to be able to be a daily vlogger. Um, I would like to try it this year, but if not next, not next, this year, I definitely would like to try to do it next year. So there's so many good content creators out there and I enjoy watching them because they inspire me to make my channel better. So, um, I've been, yeah, I've been looking at a lot of content creators and, um, just daily vloggers, you know, vlogging their everyday life. And it's very, very inspiring. So, you know, I hope to be able to accomplish that this year. And if not this year, definitely next year. But it's definitely on my list of to-do goals and achievements. So, um, I'm so thankful for the 384 people that follow me. I am striving for 400 by February, the first week in February, I say. I would love to have 400 subscribers by the first week of February. And um, it's coming. It's coming slow, but it's coming slow and organically. You know, people are starting to catch on and say, did you guys see that that chick with all that pink stuff? I think it's Ingrid's Pink World or something like that. <laughs> so, you know, people are coming on. It's It's gradual, but I'm excited about it. And I'm excited about the way that People are finding out about me and my channel. So, um, but anyway, <clears throat> I just wanted to chit chat with you guys today and say, hi, I have not abandoned you. I would never abandon you. And, um, you know, if you don't see me coming on here that often with a face-to-face -face video, just please know that it's not because I don't want to. It's just, you know, I can only do what my health allows me to do. And there are days when my health says, nope, not feeling it today, you know, and I have to go with how my body feels, you know, and I'm, I try to push myself as much as I possibly can to do things, but there are days when I just can't even do that. So bear with me, stick with me. And I promise this journey is going to be a fun journey and we're just going to continue it. And I'm so excited and so proud of myself that my channel is a year old now. I started YouTube January the 1st of 2021. So it's been a year and I am excited and proud of the growth so far. So um, I will continue this journey and, you know, see where it takes me. Everybody had to start somewhere and um, you got to be proud and you, you know, you got to be proud of where you are in the process um, you know, at the time that you're just starting something because everything takes time, you know, whether you're, you're opening a business up, it takes time for it to flourish and blossom and become what it is that you want it to be. And I feel like that's the same thing with the YouTube channel. I don't think it's any different. So, um, thank you to all of the content creators out there who make it look easy and make it look like so much fun because you guys are inspiring and you, you make those of us who are learning how to do this and really getting into this, you make us want to continue to do it. Um, I love Justine. I think Justine, hands down, is one of these bubbly, fun content creators who just makes you want to keep coming back for more. I was teasing her on the last live she did and I was telling her, I said, I wake up in the morning, I go to Starbucks and then I check your channel to see if you've uploaded yet. <laughs> I, that's what I do. I mean, her and so many others that I just thoroughly enjoy watching. So, you know, they're, they are inspirational for me and probably so many other people too. So, um, I wanted to come on here with you guys and just chit chat for a little bit. I don't want this to be a very long drawn out video because if you know me, I try to make all of my videos short, simple, and sweet to keep you coming back, you know? Um, and I know a lot of people probably think, gosh, her videos are so short. I do that on purpose because um, since I'm not daily vlogging right now and I'm just kind of shooting content about different things, I want it to be interesting, but I don't want it to be an hour long every single video. You know, sometimes that can just be a lot for people. So I try to make my videos pretty short, pretty simple, 
but sweet and entertaining at the same time so that you'll come back for more. So um, that's that's that has always been my goal. But um, so I just wanted to come on here today and tell you guys that I love you. I appreciate your support. Thank you for the people ha that have already subscribed to my channel. And thank you to the people who will subscribe to my channel. For the people that will probably see maybe this video first before any of my other videos, if you decide to just subscribe to my channel, thank you. Thank you in advance. I appreciate you and I appreciate the support and you're helping me get to where I want to be with this YouTube journey. So anyway, you guys, you know what to do because I tell you in every single video, eat your vegetables, drink your water, and take your vitamins and stay healthy. Stay healthy for yourself, your friends, your loved one, your neighbors, the kids, everybody, because in today's society, health is just the number one thing. It's just something we got to do. So do your part and do everything you can to stay healthy for yourself and others, okay? Um... I don't know when I'll be back with another face-to-face, -face, you guys, but God willing, if I am feeling the way I feel today, I will be back soon. It hopefully will not be another month when you see my face, okay? So one thing about uh, my channel, I think it's very important to do these face-to-faces because I want you to know who I am as a person and I want you to know who I am, who the person is behind the scenes, in other words. So when I shoot these videos of cookies and cupcakes and wedding videos and all this kinds of stuff, it's nice to look at that stuff, but I want you to know who's behind it and who's actually doing it. You know, I want you to know me personally. So that's why I like to do these face-to-faces. Um, also, wedding series will be starting probably in March, March or April of uh, this year. I'll start wedding season and I'll usually take wedding season all the way out to September and September the 1st is usually when I stop. So April, May, June, July, August, September. I just go all the way out to September um, and I do everything weddings. Um, I don't know if some of you know, but I am a certified event planner, but I have not been planning anything because of my health. <laughs> but um, yeah, I am a certified event planner. And weddings, weddings are my thing. You know, I love everything that goes into a wedding. I love the cakes, the shoes, the dresses, the decor, bridesmaids, groomsmen, bachelor parties, bachelorette parties, showers, teas. I love it all. So I will definitely be doing a 2022 wedding series and it will start probably in, let's just say April, probably start in April and I'll go all the way through September. Okay. So that is something for you guys to look forward to also. Um, also, for all of my crafters out here, I will be doing as many crafting videos as I possibly can. Some of the tutorials will be crafting videos. And, um, you know, I will continue to find more craft spaces and craft rooms that are pleasingly or aesthetically pleasingly to the eye because I noticed a lot of the ladies love beautiful craft spaces and rooms. So I'll continue to do those series too. All right, you guys, I'm going to get out of here. I do have some other things I need to get done today. I still need to run some errands today, but I could not let this beautiful day go by without coming on and letting you know that I have missed you. And I'm, I'm so excited about 2022 and what we are going to accomplish together in 2022. Okay. Comment below. Let me know about some videos that you guys are interested in me doing, something that you would like for me to do different, maybe that I didn't do last year. And give me some ideas, you guys. And I'm I'm all about new things, okay? All right, you guys. I love you. Take care of yourself. And I will definitely see you in the next video. Bye.